Hello. Hola. Konnichiwa. Bonjour. Erende. Welcome back to Cheats Disabled. I am your new host, Cheats Barely. Welcome. I'm replacing the former host, Brad. And I just want to say we are so glad to be back on YouTube finally. The absence is because I've been over at Twitch building something over there and it, it's been great. I've had a lot of fun. We've been live streaming every Saturday and Sunday for uh, almost two months now. And it's been crazy. The support has been crazy. We have a wonderful community of people. So happy to have them. And I've missed all of my friends over here so much. I've missed Simply ADB, Hot Lettuce, Rockstar Pool, Dan Jules, Sub-Zero MNX, and the list goes on and on and on. The people who originally supported me in my dreams of chasing content creation, I have missed you all, and I am back, ready to get involved with you guys' channel, support you tenfold, because I've missed you so much. And I hope you guys enjoy this video. This video is just an edit of a tournament we did on Sunday, the first inaugural tournament of the International Bear Wrestling Coalition. Now you might be asking yourself, what the hell is the IBWC? And it is a Federation of Bears ran through Fire Pro Wrestling, all sorts of tremendously talented wrestling bears. And this tournament was a, a thing that we did because my highest Twitch point channel redemption is win a bear. And people have been saving up for that for a while. And I decided that I was going to do a win a bear tournament, which eight people got to select bears. And uh, the bears fought in a wrestling tournament. And whatever bear won, the person that has selected that bear won the win a bear prize. And they got to make whatever bear they wanted to insert into the IBWC. We had a lot of fun doing this. I blew out my voice in the process. I hope you enjoy it. I rambled enough. I hope you've been staying beautiful. I know you have. I hope you've been staying golden. And most importantly, I hope you've been staying safe. Let's roll, roll that footage. Let's just start it. All right, welcome to Bear Championship Wrestling. I'm Cheats Barely, your color commentator for this event. Tonight, we have the Bear of the Ring, King of the Ring Tournament Invitational. Coming to the ring first, we have the Macho Bear, Root Savage, formerly known as Root Bear, but he's a little more savage now. He's ready to fight. He's ready to rip and claw his way through this tournament. And in the opening round, we've got him taken a hard match against the young cub grizzly joe now grizzly joe a lot of people think he shouldn't even be in this tournament he shouldn't even be in this company yeah. the, the rumors are that that's a man in a bear mask but who would be so dumb to do things wearing a bear mask like who would be on twitch wearing a bear mask who would be wrestling with a bear mask i don't know if i believe it or not but the rumor has it that grizzly joe is really just a man under a mask and we're gonna see, oh, Macho Bear with the claw to the face. Oh, he's giving him the noggin knocker straight to the Boston Crab, brother. Let's see what's going on here. Oh, yeah. super kick. Grizzly Joe hit the super kick. He's dragging him to the middle of the ring. He's going for the rolling senton, a little rolling thunder action on his opponent there. Macho Bear with the vertical suplex, the high angle drop. He went for the, the clothesline, but Grizzly Joe got out of the way. Grizzly yeah. Joe follows him in the ring and a Hurricane Rana. Spins him around until tilt the world Hurricane Rana. A standing moonsault. He is Grizzly Joe. He may be a man, but he has meteoric powers. He's taken to the top rope. Oh my God, a top rope Frankensteiner. He could have killed him. Yeah. Macho 
Macho Bear Root Savage dragging him out to the ring. He's kicking him in the leg. You can't be doing those that flippy shit if you got a bum knee, brother. He's trying to take his knee out. He's a little overzealous with the punches. He's hitting him with the jab, a little jiggy to jiggy to boom. a two count of close fall already in the first first round of this tournament oh a running knee he just need him right in the gym, in the mouth right in the mush he's giving another noggin knocker he's dragging him out to the middle of the ring and we are gonna see some special scoop slam dropping the knee right on his mouth can't be talking that shit with a broken jaw brother stomping him in the leg Boom, hitting him with that punch. It just dropped him. That was a hard shot. Oh, oh, he just clawed him right in the face. Now he's just kicking him right in the mouth. This is back and forth. This is a tremendous action. Another stalling vertical suplex five minutes into this match. We are seeing some heavy artillery from both bears. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Captain Wombat, you are now Grizzly Joe. Enziguri, running Enziguri from Grizzly Joe. Oh my gosh, a running clothesline. He dropped him. Oh my gosh, he's going. Fire driver! Yeah, he's in him with the jiggity jiggity jive. Boom! No, so Grizzly Joe, he does not have a superhero cake, but he is about to fly. He is about to fly, and he crossbody. One, two, 2.9. That's as close as it comes, folks. That man is hitting the map. Oh, my God. Tombstone pile driver. Shades of the Unbear Taker. He folds him up. One, two. Oh, my God. What an upset. What an upset tonight. Grizzly Joe has upset Macho Bear, Rude Savage in a four-star match. The crowd is going wild. 90% of the crowd love that match. 77 minutes in with the with the tombstone pile driver and he hooked both legs and stacked him up. What an upset. Grizzly Joe advances to the next round. Now we move on to our next match. Barry Omega versus the Space Panda. I don't know what's going to happen here. I don't know who's going to win this one. Sorry, Fruit Bat of Doom. We're keeping it. Cheats barely. We're going to skip this because I think this is copyrighted music. The Space Panda Brother. He's from the outer space, the intergalactic nightmare. I probably should have gave him to Elysium, the Elysium Nightmare. Maybe I'll change his name to the Elysium Nightmare. Who knows? Harry Omega is an accomplished wrestler. He's wrestled all over the world. Canada, Japan, America, Puerto Rico, Mexico, you name it. And Space Panda is just laying the paws, just hitting him with the left and right, hitting him all damn night. Harry Omega. Sends him off into the corner. Oh, but Space Panda said not today. He uses anti-gravity paws to go for that flip. And Kenny Omega's trying to chop him. It had little effect on the Space Panda. Now he just drops the elbow doing his shoulder blade. That's gotta hurt. And we got Special Space Panda. Maddie Cakes 2 is following this channel. Thank you for the follow, Maddie Cakes. Your Space Panda, this is the first round, the opening match. I figured out of the bears that were left, you would want Space Panda, brother. Her bear, I think her bear's up next, right? Against the under, under, unfair taker. I know, I know Maddie Cakes is your girlfriend. Nah, homie, that's our girlfriend now. No, I'm just kidding. 
basically, yeah, you're green. Would you prefer to be another color? Am I am I could I could change that later if that's a problem for you. Enziguri. We already have a purple bear. I'll, we'll figure something out, okay? We'll figure it out. We'll we'll get we'll get together. We'll figure it out later. Right now you're a green panda. Oh man, he just got the claw. He's just ripping at his intestines. Panda bear gives no fucks given today. Yeah, you get to design your bear if you win. So Space Panda makes it all the way. I'll make you whatever the hell bear you want. Fisherman Buster. Get him with the Fisherman Buster. Now he's got him in the figure four leg lock. Well, Space Panda tap. No, he flips out of it. Chop. Going nowhere. He misses with the kick. Oh, now he's just grinding him. Just grinding him out. He's got him in an arm bar with a grind, an elbow grind. That's just a rough, rough rumble there. And he's setting him up on the top rope. What are we going for here? Space Panda says, not today, mother sucker. And just knocks him off. Oh my God, what the hell was that? I don't even know what to call that. That was intergalactic spinning tornado DDT. Now he's just biting him. He's just biting him. You can't escape. We're six minutes into this, this match. Barry Omega, sponsored by Korg with the Poison Rana. Oh my God, that spike bit. The space pan on his head. Could he be setting up? He's setting him up for the one wing this world that's crazy bear action oh my god he dropped him right on his noggin straight on the dome running shooting star press three Barry Omega moves on to the next round to take on Grizzly Joe oh my god what a match we are on some tremendous bear action to start this match as only a three-star rating i i disagree i gotta give it five stars what an incredible finish the one winged angel the spiking brain buster and barry omega he moves on so in our semi-finals it'll be grizzly joe taking on barry omega and now for an anticipated match the Undertaker and abraham washington brother The Unbear Taker, dressed in all black. I'm wearing my throat out. I should have made some tea. I'm Mara Bear. I am a real bear man. Fights for the rights of every bear. I am a real bear American. Fight for your rights. Fight for your life. Bow, 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 bow. This is a clash. This takes it back to Survivor Series 1990, where The Undertaker made his debut against the immortal Hulk Hogan. Mara Bear getting smashed in the corner. Mara Bear fought with the sidewalk slam, fighting his way out. This is gonna be a hell of a matchup. This is gonna be the hardest hitting bear action that you're gonna see on Twitch, brother. Let's see. Oh my god, he's just holding him. 
just holding him, and he drops him down. Should have put some girl bears in here. Bear bear with the headbutt. Face Panda will have his chance for revenge. We are going to have lots of tournaments coming up. We're going to have Bear Royal Rumbles. We're going to have all sorts of shit going on in the IBWC, formerly known as Bear Championship Wrestling, the International Bear Wrestling Coalition. We're going to have all sorts of programs. Choke slam, he just slammed him down. Oh my God, he's gonna take it old school. He's gonna take it old school. He hit him right in the back of the head. That's a hell of a clobber. Dragon sleeper locked in. Bullet Maribear tap. No, you can't put the immortal Maribear down so easily. Kicked him in the ding dong. He was setting him up for the choke slam. This must be Hollywood Bear Hogan. Hollywood Bear. Mayor Bear represents everywhere in America, and he's chosen to represent Hollywood Bear with that low blow. But the immortal Unbear Taker. He's dead inside. His ding dong is dead. done pissed off the unbear taker with a sidewalk slam of his own he signals that's it one two and two and oh my god he almost had him if it would have been a lesser bear it would have been over but a mara bear is, is hulking up he hit him with the leg drop he hit him with the elbow drop hit him with the, uh, the leg stop and the trifecta one two it's not enough that's a two count Setting him up for the high angle, hard hitting suplex, dropping another elbow on him, kicked him right in the stomach. He sent him sidewalk slam, unbear taker counts. Both bears are down, both bears are sucking wind, brother. DDT! He hit him with the DDT. He's hitting him with the, he's hitting the ropes, running leg drop. That's gotta be it. One, two, Three, two, oh my God, I thought it was over. Legit thought it was over. Hit him with another DDT. He's sniffing the air. He can smell revenge in the air. Is it enough? He hits another leg drop. Now he's going for the pin. One, two. Oh my God, a two count. You can't keep the unbear taker down. What in the world is it gonna take to put these men away? Let's go! The Unbear Taker setting him up. Oh my god, a good just harder like a hard left ball right into the jaw is all it takes to put a bear down sometime. Both men having the same idea. Both bears are down. A mare bear is up first. Oh no! Oh the burial! He hit him with the burial! Why isn't he going for the cover? One, two! Three! Oh my no, it's not three! It's not over! It's not over! Running bear slam! Running bear slam! Oh my god! And the leg drop for good measure! And now he's stomping him! He might have made a mistake there! I'm running out of breath! This is crazy! This is insane! A high bear back body drop! Another leg drop! One! Two! Three, it's over. A Mara Bear wins. <laughs> A Mara Bear wins. Ninety-one percent of four-star rating. What a match! No bear in this tournament should hang their head. Every match has been close. Every match could have gone to anybody. And now we've got the match of the brothers. We've got 
Dozy Bros, Big Bro Boysenberry, or Middle Bro Boysenberry, and we got Blueberry, controlled by the Byron. That's a lot of confidence. Boysenberry making his way to the ring. Part of the illustrious Berry Brothers trio team, the Berry Brothers tag team. And now we're gonna see, we're gonna settle which Berry Bro is the best in the tag team division. Will it be Big Brother Blue or Middle Brother Boysen? We don't know, we're about to find out. He just slapped his big bro, says, bring it, big bro. I don't want you holding back. And he hit him with an enziguri. Step up enziguri at that. Throws him in the ring, slapped him across the chest. Big bro blue fires back with a nice little maneuver, a standing moonsault. Let's go. Oh my god. A basement drop kick doesn't doesn't do the damage it needed. Poison bear. Oh, blue bear slides under says not today. The vanishing driver. <laughs> Both of these bears know each other so well they spent their whole lives together. They know each other's moves like the back of their hands. So you're gonna see a lot of counters. You're gonna see a lot of chicanery going on. A kick rolling them over in the Boston Crab. Oh my goodness. What a match. This hell of a fight. Big Brother Blue maybe holding back a little something. But Poison Berry is not. He goes for the run under the pin. He goes for the drop kick. Blueberry just says, no, thank you, sir. And now we got to trade it off. We're going to see who really is the baddest bear of the family. And in that exchange, it was Poison. Single leg Boston Crab. He's trying to make his big brother give up. Let's go. Just stomping him in the back. Poison carrying him around. What's he doing? You now he's going to punch him in the back. My, he struck Cradle. Looking for the pin. That's just a one count. It's too early in the day to catch a blueberry sleeping, brother. Oh my god. Pop up the and drop. And now he's just stomping him in the gut. He's making the run. He's building up some in him. Basement drop kick right in the mush. Now. Oh, it's a TKO. It's a TKO. Also known made famous by the pro wrestler Xavier Magnus as the Chrono Trigger. Oh, running knee, followed by a standing moonsault. One, two, Blue looking to put his brother away, but it's just a two count. It's just a two for Blue. So he follows up with the DDT. Shades of Jake Roberts with the DDT. And he is running in it. Oh, pop up. Enziguri into the pin. Two near fall, but it's not good enough. These brothers got too much in the tank. And he, oh my God, it was a Canadian destroyer. Now he's at the top of the rope. 450 splash. That has to be it. Oh my God, how did he kick out of that? How in the hell do you kick out of a Canadian destroyer followed by a 450 splash? Big Brother Blue letting his frustration get the better of him. Just knocks his brother out to the ground. You're not going to win a match out there, buddy. Oh, my goodness. What an emotional match. He's setting him up. They're both on top. Top row Spanish fly. Top row Spanish fly. He had to kill him. Oh, my God. Blue has moved on to the semifinals. Establishing that Big Bro is best bro in the Barry Brothers tag team. What a match. What a maneuver. It could have killed somebody. And they're going to say that's a one and a half. And what freaking 
Galaxy is at a one and a half. That was a five and a half, maybe a six and a half out of five star match. This is some bullshit. This is just like when I was watching Kitchen Nightmares, or not Kitchen Nightmares, Hell's Kitchen last night, and the one chef said, man, this steak is perfect. I love the mushrooms, love everything about it. It's a seven. Hell no, it's not a seven. This was the match of the night, if you ask me. It had a Canadian destroyer. It had a top row Spanish fly. These are things that you can only see from the talent, the caliber of Blueberry. And now we move into the second round. Korg versus Captain Wombat. Just built it. Oh my God, you are built different. You are built generous with all your gifted subs on this channel. We're going right into the semifinals. I gotta get a drink. I'm gonna have to make tea next time I do this. I hope Maddie beat your ass too. We're gonna skip that because I think that's copyrighted music because that's actually Kenny Omega's music. This is gonna be a tough match for Grizzly Joe. Woo! Best the bear bout machine, Barry Omega. Grizzly Joe with the super kick. He's showing he's not here to play games. You may say that's a man in a bear mask, and he says he is a champion. He is a bear with the heart of a champion. That is a champion in a bear mask, if you ask him. blowing our vocal cords out already. Oh boy. Woo! I'm in out of shape there. He's got him in the figure four. Yeah, you broke me. Woo! Bro, it's hot. Yes, please. Yes, I will definitely take some tea. With some honey and some lemon, perhaps, or something. Yeah. Rolling thunder. Just gonna claw him in the face. Oh my god, he just jump spin kicked him in the, straight out of Cobra Kai. Right in the camel clutch. Super dick right there. That was a super dick. Super dick kick. You can't escape. Yeah. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to show Fruit Bat some love since we spawned Fruit Bat. You can't escape. You can't escape. Very Mikey telling his opponent he cannot escape. Running V trigger. The V trigger knee. One, two, no. No, that's not it. Grizzly Joe says, no, sir, not today. Five minutes in this match, a standing moonsault. Dude, not today. Grizzly Joe kicks out one more time. Grizzly Joe has shown a lot of people he may not be the biggest bear in the fight, but he might have the biggest heart. Barry wow. Omega on the top rope setting up. Oh my God, just a missile drop kick right in the mush. Oh, he was setting up for the one wing angel, I think, and buried. Grizzly Joe just kicked him in the ding dong. A stamp step up in Zaguri. Drops Grizzly Joe down, but it doesn't keep him down. A missed drop kick. Barry Omega with a super kick of his own. He's setting him up. He's tuning up the band. Oh my god, what a sweet kick. He set him up. Oh, blue thunder bomb. 
is a blue thunder bomb enough? No, that's as close as it comes though, folks. Will we see the one winged angel? No one kicks out of the one winged angel. Chop, the trading is the chops, trading of the kicks. Step up in Zaguri one more time. Both bears are down. Suck and win. He's picking him up. He turned around. He knew what was coming. He's like, you're not catching me with that one wing angel. And he picks him up again. Oh my God, it's a running, running V trigger knee. That is the prelude. Four. It's too late. No, he sends him in the ropes. He's setting him up. Snapdragon suplex. Snapdragon suplex. He's hit all of his moves. So that means it's time for the one wing angel. And that's all she wrote. No one kicks out of the one wing angel. Harry Omega moves on to the finals. Seventy-four. Who is grading these matches? These people are dumb. All right, we've got the Amara Bear versus the Blueberry. I am a real Amara Bear. Fight for the rights of every bear. I am a real Amara Bear. Fight for your rights. Fight for your life. Bow, 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 bow. When it comes crashing down and it hurts the side. Okay. Blueberry. Blueberry beat his own brother to get here. If he could do the things he did do his brother, there's no telling what he'll do to a bear ham Washington. right out the gate oh my gosh another nice little flip you can see some of the furs come off of abraham washington this has been a tough fought tournament so far couple fight do your little dance dance i don't know I think you said if you win you're gonna you're gonna give subs right so maybe i could turn this into your favor i think i think if you win you have to give subs and maddie says if she wins you have to give subs i'm just kidding you don't have to give subs <laughs> you have to give subs you're giving plenty of subs with the late drop he's looking for the early finish too oh my god it was almost over it was almost over He was looking to send Mare Bear was looking to send Blue home early. <laughs> okay. You are going against the greatest wrestler probably of all time and probably the highest rated bear in the Fed though. Oh, putting the bricks to him. Nice little DDT. Huh. I don't know what's going on. leg drop that's over that's a one that's a two that's a three respawn to fruit bat with the key the hello fruit bat oh my god we might have just ended a happy relationship i need my straw 
Yeah, drink tea with a straw. Oh, that's nice. That's nice with the throat. All right. So we have got the finals. Barry Omega, commanded by Korg. A Bear Ham Washington, commanded by Maddie. I oh, you got, brought me another stock. Yep. Yeah, two fruit bass spawn drops. Give some love to fruit bat. And it comes crashing down and it hurts inside. Bow, 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 bow. I'm a real Fight for the rights of every bear. I am a real America bear. Barry Omega, the best of this generation, and America bear, the best of all time. The boats, the bear of all time. Bear bout machine in the immortal America bear. Fruitbat is on in the chat. You guys, show Fruitbat some love. Give her a heart emoji. Tell her you love her. As I turn the hell, dude. He is hyping these matches up in the chat. I hope you guys are enjoying this content. Is this, if you are watching this, is this something you'd like to see on a regular basis, like a once a week basis? Would you like to see fair wrestling action? Would you like to see me blow my voice out every week doing crazy color commentary? Would you like to make your own bears, sponsor bears, and continue on the storylines to see where this goes we're gonna have championships we're gonna have storylines we're gonna have number one contenderships we're gonna have all sorts of shit like it's gonna be crazy and if you guys are here for it we'll have it on twitch every damn week guys at least once a week i might move streaming up i might stream three times a week just to have a bear championship wrestling day with the scoop slam. Tell me, Byron, are you feeling some extra bear championship wrestling action in the future? Ah, running bear slam. Might be another short match. Five minutes in. Oh, I asked the chat. I said, first of all, give Fruit Bat and some love for the Fruit Bat content drop. Respond, Fruit Bat. Since that's your thing, you got to give her some love. Two, I said, would you be hyped to see more Bear Championship Wrestling action in the future? Would you like to see your character get his revenge? Would you like to see storylines, matches, tournaments, Royal Rumbles, and all sorts of bear and wrestling action in the future? All right, that sounds good. He's hulking up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, hulking up. Because after this stream, I'm going to work on a little introductory video, a little storyline setup for the International Air Wrestling Coalition. Hasn't been a year, it's been like 
Yeah, almost yeah. here. Final driver. Big bear back body drop and the leg drop. But Barry Omega is back to the sidewalk slam. Mara Bear ain't playing no games. You can't escape. Either is Barry Omega. It's been almost a year to be fair. Two count. It's a good thing this tournament's almost over because my voice is hot. One, two. Oh my god, that's as close as it gets. That's as close as it gets, baby. A running. Oh, he hit him with the running V trigger. The running V trigger. That's got to put him down, too. No. Just a two count. Hit him with the jiggity jab, jab, and another. Oh. Ooh, that was a lot of punches. And another running leg drop. That has to be it. One, two, three. That's it. Amara Bear is your tournament champion. What a match. I hope you enjoyed that. If you made it all the way to the end, thank you. Uh, if you'd like, catch us this Saturday on Twitch. We'll be doing Resident Evil 7 Biohazard. And on Sunday, we'll be doing more IBWC, just like this you saw right here. As always, stay golden, stay beautiful. And most importantly, stay safe. Love you all. Goodbye.